Hello and welcome back. We are about to go on a voyage. Out to sea. Ezio, no, we're here. not. Over here. Yep, I hear you. Where? Where am I meant to go? You just said here, you didn't say where here is. Ezio, here. Over here. Yes, where is here? I don't see it. Nah, uh, I'm only playing stupid. Anyway, where is it? I believe it's in this place anyway. At least we go a little further. Oh, hi. Eccolo, there! Eccolo yourself. Here. Over here. Is it on the boat? I can't remember. Thought it was up here. So at least a uh, synchronization. My legs. Um, damn, where is it? Is it on the boat? Maybe on the here. boat. Over here. I don't see... Ah yes, there's a gangplank. Bert. Ezio! Here! Over here! <coughs> Man, the rigging! Ezio! Here! Over here! Uh, if I don't find it in this boat pretty quickly, and I end up going mad from him saying that, I'll pause the recording and I'll find where it is. So. Ezio, here, over here. Okay, I'm starting to go mad already about that. Uh, that's the most annoying thing in the world. Ezio, here, over here. You know what, actually. I'll just do it then now to shut him the hell up. Hey Leonardo, you, you're not annoying you me. You saved my life. I did what had to be done. You would have done the same. <sighs> I doubt it. Bravery is not my strong suit. I owe you a debt, brother. Di niente. Tutti a bordo! Fra poco si salva! Sorry. That's our traghetto. Venezia waits. Where's your pass? What pass? You don't have a pass? You cannot enter Venezia without a pass. Who invited you? Uh, nobody. Basta! No pass, no entrance! <laughs> don't worry, Leonardo. I'll come up with something. Don't just stand there! I need help! Also, no, an attitude adjustment. Dun dun dun! Sarcasm. Um, maybe now I can find it. Oh great, now we have her saying it. Ah oh, good, she's not as loud. Can't hear her over here. Uh, stop creaking chair, please. I really need a new chair. Oh, you end up hearing it from my chair. Getting a little irritating. It's 
It's one of these stupid ass buildings, I'm pretty sure. find it so and give me a wee minute. Hello and welcome back. If anyone's wondering I finally found it all in this tower. So let's go and get it. Well for finally I mean about ten minutes later. Oh yeah. Something was up there. Something abandoned long ago. These formidable ah. Are these formidable weapons are adversaries of freedom plan to consolidate their territory to exploit and control and finally destroy JF Kennedy. Shadows. Deep underground. It was easy. Hmm. Why didn't they just remove the Apple of Eden then? Before they took the fall? Or am I just being a bit over the top and thinking about it too much? Ah, whatever. Anyway, let's go and save her because she's been moaning about it often enough. No one's done anything yet. <laughs> Well, it always has to be me. Mm -hmm. Ah, no, nah, I like it. Alright, okay. The main reason she's not a thing is because she can't swim. <coughs> Don't know if that's for the real character. Um, if the real character couldn't swim, but this version of the character at least can. But we get to now see one of the newer aspects of this one over Assassin's Creed, um, the first one. There's no really any way of saying it, just Assassin's Creed, the first one. Okay, so. Yeah, yeah, just wait. Ezio loves to save the damsel in distress. So you can just wait a wee minute. And we'll be there. Madonna. Oh, you're good. The ladies must like you. <laughs> I wasn't looking to impress. Only to help someone in distress. Which is exactly why you impress. And you are Messer... Auditore. But please, only Ezio. 
I'm Katerina. Now, Ezio, we must find you suitable reward. Do you have any suggestions? There is perhaps something you could help me with. I'm all ears. Okay. Alright, it doesn't tell you right now, fine then. Yes, Signora. Whatever you say, Signora. He won't trouble you anymore. I took care of it. <laughs> Thank you, Katarina. Perhaps we'll see each other again. Should you ever find yourself in the city of Forley, it would be my pleasure to welcome you. I look forward to enjoying your hospitality. <laughs> Please accept my most humble apologies, Messere. Had I known. <laughs> It's quite all right, my friend. Anywho, let's continue. Be careful, Ezio. Do you know who that was? My next conquest. <laughs> uh, I don't think so, Ezio. That's Caterina Sforza, daughter of the Duca di Milano. Her husband is... Husband? See, si. her husband is the Lord of Forley. That woman is as powerful and dangerous as she is young and beautiful. Sempre come una donna per me. Ah, you know it's you. Or maybe you don't. Maybe this is your first time seeing this as in street. Everything all right? Better than all right. You're making amazing progress. Amazing's quite a strong word. Then why are we stopping? Prolonged exposure to the Animus can have, uh, side effects. <laughs> awesome. It's nothing to worry about. You haven't shown any of the symptoms. Symptoms? What symptoms? Degradation of cognition, temporal hallucinations, multiple awareness issues, overlapping realities, you know. So what you're saying is... What we're saying, Desmond, is if you're not careful, you may not need the Animus to visit with your ancestors. Which wouldn't be a bad thing, assuming you could control it. Up until now, though, no one has. <laughs> Subject 16. We have safeguards, Desmond. And they kept him in the Animus for way too long, sometimes days at a time. We're being careful with you. I hope so. Anyway, I was hoping we could test out your skill retention. See if you've picked up some of Ezio's abilities. I'm game. Great. Meet me downstairs when you're ready. Hey, eyes up, eyes up. <laughs> so, can we run, please? Yeah, thank you. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Take too long, take too long, take too long, take too long. Come on. Coffee. So what's the plan? We're gonna see what you've managed to retain. So we need to drink coffee. Come coffee. on. Uh oh, coffee. Obster goes out there, looking for us. They're better funded and better equipped, so it's only a matter of time before they find this place. We need to be ready for them when they do. I want okay. you to activate the warehouse's defense system. I'll let you figure out how to reach the sensors. Oh, come on. Not even a hint? Open your eyes, Desmond. <laughs> there, on him. Why, hello. Uh, Lucy? I'm seeing things. Do the hallucinations last longer than 30 seconds? No. Then it's nothing to be worried about. It'll pass. <laughs> So, how am I doing? You've picked up every single one of Ezio's skills. I just walked the over and pressed the fantastic. bloody... Another day or two and we'll be done. All I did is walked over and pressed one button. What am I meant to see? Alright, you gotta tell me. Why Ezio? Why Italy? I mean, we could have just gone back to Altair again. Followed him during his early years. It started with 16. <laughs> ah, good old subject 16. 
He repainted my room, you know. With his blood. <laughs> I'd been going through his files. Vidic flagged a couple of his Animus sessions. A bunch of different ancestors, different dates and locations. Ancient Africa, the Middle East. But towards the end, he became obsessed with Italy. I think he knew about the vault. A few of the records of his later Animus sessions are missing. And the sessions that are there... After everything the Templars put him through, after everything I put him through, it's all scrambled. If we hadn't pushed 16 so hard, we'd have the answers already. And maybe he'd still be alive. Hmm. Yeah, it's always peace. Whoa, blurry version. So you're after the Codex and the Vault. I knew you had an ancestor in Italy who was at the center of all of this. Oh, I see it now. Oh crap. Can't fall too far, can we? Hey, over here. Right. All right, I think we're done for the day. You should get some rest. Lucy, what happened to 16 wasn't your fault. You were just as much a prisoner as I was. Thanks. Good night, Desmond. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Okay, so can we hurry up then? She's giving me the finger. Chase her! Horse, horse, horse. Hmm. Is it significant? What the hell? What is this? Where am I? It's Aker. Altair. Not even in the animus. I must have passed out. Just having some kind of weird dream. No one can sleep for who knows how long. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. Oh, can't assassinate. Yeah, well. But do you remember that female knight at the end of the last one? That must be his target. Yep. That's his target. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get her. Oh, missed. Come on, Ezio, you can do it. She is. Get her. I'm wondering 
wonder why the guards aren't attacking. Oh, okay. Hmm. Now we know that she's his target. Sideways, sideways, there. Just, nope. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, sorry. <laughs> I broke your torch. What? Uh, torch. Lantern. Let's go and get the target. Hello! I'm gonna kill you now. Or I'm gonna stab you at least. It's the one from <laughs> What's her name? Maria. Yeah. I wonder what he wants with her. Whoa, alright, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> How else do you think you were can well, your ancestor who's conceived? Good thing his cloak's white. Okay. So what, you ran away from the Order of Templars? Sorry to barge in on you like this, but it's getting late and we were... Hey, you okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, all good. Weird dreams, that's all. Alright. I'll let you get ready. See you in a few. <laughs> Ah, good of you to join us. Sorry. Long ah, night. you prick. What a good of you to be a approach. dick. Leave him alone. Well, you'll forgive me if I want to get some actual work done. Oh, madness, isn't it? Sean, please, that's enough. All right. So when can I kill him? Oh, talk to the... Wait a minute, those triangular fans... Uh, near enough. <laughs> Don't think that's the most mm, useful shape for a fan. Ah, good, he doesn't want to talk. Great. Okay, let's see. Hey. <coughs> uh, hi. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Everything's fine. You sure? We lost two more teams last night. That's eight more of us, just... gone. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do anymore. It just keeps getting worse and worse. Hey, remember what you told me? You gotta have faith. And look, here we are, safe and sound. <laughs> For how long? And when they find us, then what? When that happens, if that happens, we'll deal with it. <laughs> I'll keep you safe. Anyway, enough with my little breakdown. I should get back to work. And so should you. Okay. Awkward pause. So, you got anything to say? No. Okay. Oh, have you? 
No. So, next episode, we'll stumble inside the church.